Good morning, and you're watching another episode of Ryan Phelan's epic morning show in the morning. And uh, today, today is Groundhog Day. <laughs> so, Mr. Balzac Billy, that's Balzac, is in the town. Billy has told us to expect another six more weeks of winter. Okay, that, that's cool. But what else is there about Groundhog Day, Ryan, that you can tell us? Well, I can tell you that it's one of my favorite movies. Um... I like uh, I like um, Groundhog Day because Bill Murray he's awesome he's he's a god when it comes to uh, uh, comedy but also I like the premise where he kind of wakes up every day and experiences the same things over and over again and like you may with your job in in real estate you know I kind of see trends and kind of see things that happen over and over again and like Bill Murray stepping off the curb. Um, or trying to get a date with a girl, he tries different approaches, and um, he learns that, wait a minute, there's this puddle at this curb, and so he learns to avoid that, he learns the right things to say and when to say them to, to, um, to go on a date with this girl, and um, in real estate, you kind of see the same things, it's like, you know, buyers will come into houses, and ah, I don't like this, and I don't like that, or that looks messy, and you, know, you learn what the turnoffs are for buyers. So how does that help? That helps when you're going to sell. There's a lot of things, I remember a commercial years ago about going nose blind being one of them. So maybe you at one point smoked in the house and there's a smoke smell or perhaps your bathroom fan sound like it sounds like a jet engine or there's a small crack in one of the tiles that you just you don't even see anymore because you live in the house and it's just it's just a, a daily occurrence. But for someone that's viewing your home for the first time, they're going in there with a bit of a critical eye and they're looking for these things. And if they see too many of them, your home may be a turn off. So what do you do? Um, you could do, we talked about another um, episode doing a pre-listing home inspection, or perhaps you can get, um, just get a handyman to come in with a critical eye and say, hey, here are some cheap or inexpensive fixes that we can do to um, to create a better visual for the home or an overall experience upon showing. Um, I work with one of these handyman, uh, handyman companies, uh, Marsha Miller at 403 Handyman. I've done, uh, I've done even a podcast with her. Check out the Epic Phelan podcast, by the way. Um, there are some really good ones on there. But um, yeah, to go in there in advance and just kind of fix up some of these small touches um, is huge. One of the big things, again, um, the fans, your bathroom fans, um, they can just sound atrocious. Fixing that is super cheap. It's just usually a matter of replacing or even cleaning the motor and it could be done. So it could be, you know, $50 to $100 fix. Um, the other thing is just like little touch-ups in paint. Um, that can be a, a very easy, inexpensive fix. And I know a lot of people, the big, the big thing is selling your home. Oh, I just want to sell it as is. Well, maybe doing some of these things, you don't have to do a full house remodel. I mean, understandably, yeah, that could be expensive and really dip into, um, uh, the, the equity that you get back out of your home. So, Talk, talk to a realtor, talk to myself, have me come in. Um, I can point out a few things that are going to, to um, attract the attention of buyers and maybe not such a good way, but then we can bring in um, 403 Handyman and they can tell us uh, what they could do um, on the, uh, I was gonna say on the cheap, I don't like that word because on the inexpensive side of things. So, if you like what you see, if you like what you're hearing, if you have any questions about real estate or how to sell your home faster and for more money, just uh, leave a comment below or call me. Um, very easy to find, Ryan Phelan, Remax Complete Realty. And, uh, you know, do the whole heart thing, like, subscribe. I always don't know what side is, uh, subscribe. <laughs> and uh, until next time, Stay epic.
<laughs> All right.